Hey, now one of the biggest questions in that you're a buyer, is it a good time to buy? I get that question a lot. And I want to tell you right now, as of yesterday and today, there are 99 new listings. Two are under contract, contingent on something happening, probably inspections or loan approval. One is impending and right now seven sold. So between 24 hours, that's the status right now. So there are a lot of listings. And one of the thoughts that's out there exactly is that because the interest rates have gone up, typically about 10% of the buyers um, fall off the market. So with that being said, sellers are now seeing that their listings, their properties are getting on the market longer. They're staying on the market longer. There's not that feeding frenzy where there are you know, multiple offers coming up and a lot of competition with buyers that are waiving inspections and um, asking for repairs or any contingencies. So that is dropping dramatically um, and consistently. So that's the good news. So with that being said, as a buyer, you have more of the ability to negotiate. So buyers are now uh, being able to go to sellers and say, hey, I want those inspections. I want the appraisal contingency. I want you know to go through repairs and ask for some things to be done. Um, so you have more negotiating power as this market starts to switch and convert. Also, um, with the, um, those things you can better negotiate, again, like I said with that, um, and the rates being, you know, 5.5, 5.3, um, still historically low. I mean, I, I remember when my in-laws bought a house in 1987, my goodness, their interest rate was 11%. Um, years later, my parents were at 8 and 10%. So 5.3, 5.5, that's still historically low. Um, and again, what you got to think in your mindset when you're a buyer is exactly, you're going to date the rate and marry the house. So that's not to say, you know, you're maybe not comfortable with the 5.5, just because you hear all your friends you know, years ago uh, at a lower rate, you can refinance in a couple years. So don't forget that's an option you have in the future. But um, it is a good time to buy for all of those reasons date the rate, marry the house, um, be able to negotiate more. Uh, sellers are getting, having a, a lot of price reductions because they're seeing that feeding frenzy and they're getting a little bit panicky, like they used to get three or four, five, seven, ten offers. My goodness, one agent told me 30 offers on one listing. So that is no more because the rates uh, exactly have gone up from they, what they were years ago, but still historically low. So with that being said, things are staying on the market again longer. Uh, it's less feeding frenzy and it gives a buyer more, more options in negotiating with a seller. But again, happy to help when you're looking, uh, going forward, wanting to look at homes, just make sure you get that pre-approval done, the credit pool, pool and all your paperwork in with the lender. And then give me a call and let me know uh, what schedule, what days you're off and I can match my schedule to yours. Again, it's Melissa Deals with Lotus Realty. Thank you so much for using HomeBot. You're gonna love it. There's a lot of information that it sends you. And if there's anything specific or have any questions, feel free to reach out.